good morning. I just went to the mailbox and I had a really nice package in the mail waiting for me and uh, I talked to Peter Dries and he asked me some questions and I gave him some answers and so he sent me the original box of goodies. I gave him my feedback and so now this is the return box. So we're going to open this up. Sort of. Alright. Got me a little box here. And the first thing we're going to pull out of here is, I do believe, maybe the reformulated. Is that reformulated? I'm not sure. But I got a jar of creeping death. Which y'all know you've seen my video um, on this product. It's it's really good. So my suggestion was for them to um, make it a little thicker because you know you could throw it in the water maybe twice and then it just kind of melts off because here in Texas, my, the water gets like flaming hot. I know the last water temperature we had was, we had taken was in the 80s. So, you know, the water's pretty warm. And as y'all know, with any dip bait, um, the warmer the water, the faster it kind of breaks down and melts off. I'm going to open this up. And I already know it's going to smell. Because <laughs> it does that. And, oh yeah, see, it doesn't look nothing like it did before in ooey. I'm going to have to shut that. I'm in my house. <laughs> wow. Okay. Um, I know this is reformulated because the last one wasn't this color. So they, they've done something to it. So I'm excited to check this out. But what I was most excited about is look at this. These this is called Plastic Insanity Six Inch Worm Bass Beast. Look at this. Just tons of plastics. Hold on, let me I'm gonna open this because I'm excited now. <laughs> Should have had this stuff open already. That's all right. We're gonna open this stuff up. Oh my goodness! There are three, four bags of plastics here. So this one, multiple colors. They look like they're in some pretty juicy liquid here. Ooh, and I smell it too. Wow. Ooh, yeah. That's a uh, potent. So, those are going to be nice. These are just like, uh, maybe little finesse worms. This is called Bass Feast. And this is Split Tail. I see the difference now. Okay. If y'all can see the difference, let me see if I can get one separated from another. Y'all see how slick that is? Okay, here we go. Y'all see the split tail on this one? Here we go. Well, kind of, sort of. Oh, yeah. And look at that. Just... Okay, there's that one. But this one is just tapers off into like a worm tail. See it? It's not split. So I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's going to work. Those are awesome. And then, and Peter, I apologize because you know what? I had a bag of these. But, um, that's okay. What I'm going to do, since I already have a bag, um, I'm just going to maybe put it in a giveaway. And I apologize. I, I didn't realize that I had already gotten this in the last package y'all sent. And, um, but maybe we'll do a giveaway. I'm coming up on 1500 here pretty quick. I'm like 50 away. That's the anise flavor. Oh, whatever it is. 
it'll catch something. Um, those are nice. Those are super nice. And then we have, I don't know if you can see this, but it's a split tail, but it's a clear plastic with flakes in it. There's clear with black flake, and if you can see, I'm, gonna, I'm trying to separate, there we go. And then there's kind of a clear with gold flake. Oh my god, these are going to be so good. And then there's a clear, let me see if I can. <laughs> then there's a clear, oh my goodness, with red flake. Okay, so then we have, um, here we go. We have these bait saver hooks. Oh, and I don't think I did that right because I think I got it all messed. Yeah, I got it all messed up. There we go. All right, and then that just holds it on. Oh my goodness, those are gonna be so cool. I've never used these hooks before, so I'm gonna try that out. And that is what is that? Five odd. Okay. And then we have what are these catfish hooks? Which I love. The, I already used hook setter hooks. Um, they're circle hooks. I know for a fact they work. I catch fish every single time. Um, and it, as far as I know, I've never lost a fish on one of these. I'm pretty sure. But it's a circle hook. It's a four out circle hook. And let me take one out. Because um, I want to show y'all. These hooks are so good. So here, I'm going to use it on the back of here. And these are offset hooks. So you see how straight on they're offset. And I like these because I think it gives you a better chance. Here we go. Look at the look at the tip of this hook and that barb. Look at that. I mean that, y'all ain't nothing getting out of that. I love the way that barb bends down. So when they go to jerk away, it just went, you know, it just sets right in it. And I have, I swear, y'all, these are the best hooks I've used. And that's all I have in my tackle box now. They're on my other ones. Wait. Um, then we have some more catfish hooks. And these are 6 odd circle hooks. And I'll, this is another thing I like about these hooks. I'll, I'll show you on the 6 odd. See how the eye, here, let me use this again. There we go. See how the eye sets back like that instead of going straight up right here? I like that. I, and the, I, don't, I don't know why I like that. But if you're going to snail a hook, that's going to be that's gonna be a dead set right there. Plus the tip and the barb on these hooks just the same as the other ones. And I'm telling you, with this right here, that's a deadly <laughs> for the fish. That's deadly, man. So I love these hooks. I'm so glad he sent me more hooks because um, I'll use those all day, every day. And then I just got another pack of the Bait Saber. These are so cool. I can't wait to use these. And I want to thank Hooksetter.com. I want to thank Muddy River Catfishing. Um, I want to thank everybody for taking me on pro staff at Hooksetter and uh, the whole team everybody i appreciate it and i'll let you know watch for a video coming soon because we're gonna try this out y'all i'm going to the creek see you later